This segment will show you how to attach your rear reflectors and how to prepare your snow thrower for use. Now, if your tractor is not equipped with rear reflectors, assemble the supplied rear reflectors to the rear fender. Place the reflectors part VV as close to the bottom of the fender and as far apart as the shape of the fender will allow. Then peel off the backing that covers the adhesive and firmly stick on the reflectors. Now, let's take the following steps to prepare to use the snow thrower. First, make sure that all assembly instructions have been completed and that all bolts and nuts have been properly tightened. Make sure the correct drive belt was installed. Make sure the drive belt and auger belt are routed properly around the pulleys and inside the belt keepers. Check the discharge chute for proper rotation. Check the operation of the tilt control for the upper chute. Verify that the lift handle will lock into and release from the raised transport position. For more information on this, please refer to the service and adjustment section of the owner's manual. Check the skid shoe adjustment. You can refer to the service and adjustment sections for more information on this as well. The following additional items are available from Sears to help enhance the performance of your snow thrower. Tire chains, which can be installed to improve traction. Rear wheel weights, which can be installed in addition to the rear weight tray to also improve traction. And a snow cab, which can be installed to help protect against wind and blowing snow.